I'm dressed like a turkey. <laughs> Get ready, because this is year six of daily vlogging. So this is really weird. I'm I'm working right now, but Nola had played like she has the I got her a new like wand toy that she really likes. Well, at least she did, and and now something has happened where now when I like wave it around for her to play with, she runs away from it. But like this just happened today. Like she just played with it like an hour ago. And I made, it didn't, it didn't hit her or anything like that. Like, didn't, I, so I put it away. Like, I'll put it back out while I'm, um, when I'm gone so she can play with it if she wants. But I put it away for now. I was like, that's weird. I swear, there are literally multiple times where I just happen to, like, see an unfamiliar name, like, like my post on Instagram. And I'm like, oh, I wonder who this is. And I click on it and I'm like, I know who this person is. How long have they been following me? And I didn't know. For example, this one, she is at the same church that I go to, but she's involved on like the parking team. So like I walk by her in, in the parking lot a whole ton. And there was one time a few months ago that she was like out of the blue. She was like, hey, like, I just want to say like, I really loved your short film. And I was like, oh my, like, thank you so much. Oh my gosh. I didn't know how she'd really found it or whatever. Come to find out, I once again, I click on this unfamiliar name who's just liked my post and that's who it is. And I'm like, how long has she been? Like, we don't really know each other, but I'm like, how long has she been following me that I've had no idea? Like, Another what? day where I have barely vlogged, sorry. Um, but I finished with work. It's 8.33, so I finished like two hours ago. Um, and then I packed my clothes for leaving tomorrow, um, filmed the video that I have, um, for the person who's coming to take care of Nola, um, so she could see where everything is, um, confirmed with her the pay rate and stuff, which I need to make sure, you know what, I'm even just gonna leave that out right now, because I don't want to forget tomorrow morning, um, and then I was finally responding back to the email that I got yesterday at the end of the day and copying my managers on it and texting my managers and saying, hey, just so you guys know, this happened. And then the people, the person who's interested in me casting that thesis that's happening earlier ne early next year, she had written to me on Wednesday and was like, hey, like, this is the schedule. These are the characters we're looking for. Like, what is kind of your pay rate? But I've learned I have a habit of underselling myself. I do. So instead, what I came back with is I said, hey, do you and your team have a pay rate, like, uh, range in mind already? If so, let me th know what that is, and I'll talk to, you know, my team, my managers who are copied here. I said, if not, no worries. I will talk to my team still and kind of get their advice on what they suggest. So anyway, because as I said, I have a habit of totally underselling myself. I already did the math on the budget that they sent me, and I know how much room they still have available in the budget. I know I am not the only... <laughs> The casting is not the only thing that's left. I can't remember if paying actors was involved, was in that budget already or not. Um, anyway, so I know they have a decent amount of money left over. Um, but of course, that's for, as I said, probably a variety of different things. It's good that you need to have leftover money in your budget because there are going to be things that you don't realize cost money and they do cost money. And so then you're like, if you've already spent all your budget, you're like, crap, I've already spent all my budget. But if you have a good chunk left over, that is great. Anyway, took care of that. I packed my clothes. I'm just going to pack my bag of other stuff real quick. Minus like my laptop, obviously, once I'm done, until I'm done with it tonight. Um, yeah, there's just, yeah, lots going on. I feel, ba feel bad that I'm leaving NOLA like only two weeks after AFM. But I'm only gone for a few days. Only a few days. Only like three full days and then I'll be I'm back. I'm heading to bed. Um, I did get a chance to read some of my book tonight, which was nice because wasn't sure if I was going to. But um, I also packed the books that I will bring with me on the trip. Um, <laughs> packing four books. Five if you're including the one that I'm bringing with me. But it's, it's very... I'm like less than 100 pages from the end of it. Because um, it's only like 250 something. So I read most of it tonight. So... I plan on, like, finishing that tomorrow, like, after work or something. So, hi, Nola. 
Um, as I said, I feel bad that I'm leaving her again for a few days, but it's much less than last time. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. All my social media is in the description. Love you all.